Stop the 4th of July fireworks show because of concerns about sea lines in La Jolla continuing this morning. A judge listening to arguments on both sides. ABC 10 News reporter Marie Cornell was in the courtroom for the hearing and shows us why the judge is waiting to make a decision. In court, the judge says he wants more time to review the documents as well as the arguments before making a decision. But there obviously is a time crunch because this fireworks show is scheduled to happen on the 4th of July. The Animal Protection and Rescue League has filed a complaint against Deborah Marengo and her company, asking a judge to keep them from launching fireworks over La Jolla Cove on the 4th of July. The complaint says the fireworks will harm newborn sea lion pups as we are in the middle of pupping season. In court, Brian Pease, the attorney representing the Animal Protection and Rescue League, says by having this fireworks show at this specific location, so close to the sea lions, Marengo would be breaking rules. The animals are protected by federal law, so there is a process and we've laid it out for them. The request for judicial notice is exactly what the defendants would need to do um, in order to launch these fireworks in a manner that may disturb or, or cause uh, impact or harm to these marine mammals. And they just have refused to follow that process. But Marengo's attorney argued they have what's needed to legally put the fireworks show on, adding this is an event that's funded by the community and has been happening for the last three decades. There should be some evidence of harm after 33 times, and, and I'll get there. But it's important to note that the evidence establishes it's in the same location, in the same amount, the same duration. And this is a small, this is a small show, about 600 shells, 20 to 25 minutes. Marengo's attorney also pointed out that there's an economic impact to this decision as there are already several businesses that have prepared for that extra foot traffic in light of this scheduled fireworks show. Reporting from downtown, Marie Cornell, ABC 10 News.